You know, deer weren't much of a problem in our ancestors' gardens. In fact, they had a special name for them. They called them lunch. Now, if you live in deer country and try to have a landscape, you probably have other names for deer. However, ballistic measures are not exactly an appropriate way to control them in the urban setting. One of the best ways we can manage deer is by planting plants that they don't care to eat. Now, we don't want to call any plant deer proof because deer will tend to nibble on almost anything. However, there are plants they prefer to stay away from. Perhaps a plant has a pungent odor or taste or maybe foliage that is very fuzzy or perhaps prickly with thorns. Some of the great plants that you can use in your central Texas landscape include this blue blooming plumbago. Plumbago is a beautiful plant that looks tender and succulent, but deer tend to avoid it. Another good choice is Jerusalem sage. Jerusalem sage has a beautiful yellow bloom during part of the year, but then the rest of the year has a nice gray foliage that's really quite attractive. Many of the ornamental grasses, especially the native grasses, work quite well. I like miscanthus and purple fountain grass. The salvias, like Mexican bush sage, salvia gregii, are also avoided by deer in most cases. For a low growing ground cover, try lamb's ear or santalina in either the gray or green form. With your common sense tip on avoiding deer with resistant plants rather than going ballistic, I'm Skip Richter.